Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I know it has been a while. I told myself I would be on it like every week uploads, but life happens. I have two children, pregnant with another. So it's just been a lot. Um, but I'm here to tell you guys about my pregnancy um, and what's really been going on. So, my last video was 19 weeks pregnant. I am currently 23 weeks now. Um, I'll be 24 weeks tomorrow, so I'm a little behind. Um, but I'm going to tell you guys my symptoms for 20 weeks, 21 weeks, 22 weeks, and 23 weeks. And um, I will show you Belly and show you a picture of baby girl from her 20-week anatomy scan. So, to start off, I have them written down. That's why I'm looking over here. Um, for 20 weeks at my appointment, um, they give you the little cup you have to pee in every appointment, I'm pretty sure. Um, so, I went to the bathroom with my little cup, and I don't know what I was thinking. I used the bathroom and didn't use the cup. And that's the first time that's ever happened to me in three pregnancies. And I felt so dumb. So, then I have to walk out and I'm like, um, I peed but not in the cup. And she's like, oh, it's okay. Like, you can come back anytime during your appointment and pee in the cup for us. And I'm like, okay, thank goodness. Um, I stepped on the scale, which I don't like to do. And yes, I know I'm pregnant and I'm going to gain weight. But like I've said before... I just had a baby nine months ago, and so I started off a lot heavier. Um, and so now I'm the heaviest I've ever been, and it's a lot to deal with. It's hard, it's depressing, stressful. Um, I don't like the way I look, um, but I know I'm growing a baby, so I just need to get over that and just deal with it. But when I was 20 weeks and I got on the scale, I had gained 13 pounds from my first appointment. Um, I don't even want to know right now. And I don't remember the exact weight. I just have gained 13 pounds on here. Um, during my sonogram, baby girl was breech, which like really scared me at first because I've had two vaginal births that were literally perfect. Um, but she said, there's no worries. Like the baby moves so much. It just so happens that at that time when I had my sonogram, she was turned upside down. Um, so, we will see. I have another appointment next Wednesday. I'm not sure if it's a sonogram or not, but hopefully, um, hopefully she turns when it's time um, because C-section, that would just really scare me and that's a whole nother thing I have to think about. Um, the tech also that did my sonogram said that baby had, um, a long, thin head, which I was like, um, okay. Um, I have a round shaped face. My husband has a more oval shaped face. I'd say his face is long, I guess, but I was like, okay, that's not really anything I want to hear. Um, and then that she had big feet and I'm like, okay, well, my husband has average size feet, and I wear a seven, seven and a half. I think that's average. So, I don't really know. Hopefully, <laughs> she comes out looking normal. Um, and that she is 12 ounces. Date is still on track for June 13th. Heart rate was 141. So, that was really 20 weeks pregnant. Um, 21 weeks, my... Stomach started to really start feeling more tight, feeling shortness of breath um, very easily. I mean, I go up my stairs and down my stairs and I like can hardly breathe. Um, my cravings are very random. It's not like I crave a certain thing. It's like I'm watching TV and someone has a bag of chips in the TV show. And then I'm like, oh, I really want Lay's chips. And most of the time, I don't have what I want, so <laughs> I have to make my husband go get it, or I just have to suffer and have whatever is the closest thing at my house. Um, 
I am having cervical mucus, which is TMI, I guess. Um, but if you're watching this, I'm pregnant. So I'm going to say what I need to say for you guys. Um, it's pretty much like discharge, if you know what that is, or have that, which I think every woman does, I guess. But um, I don't really remember that with my other two pregnancies. I think I was just thinking it was discharge, but someone the other day told me that it was cervical mucus. So that's that. Oh, and baby girl's crib is in. I went with a metal crib this time instead of a wooden crib. Um, I just love the look of it, and it's so pretty. It's metal and cloth. I will put in a little clip at the end of the video to show you guys. Um, her room theme is going to be swans. So, haven't really decorated the room so much. Not really focused on that right now. Um... I have her dresser. I just got Farah a tall dresser, and we took Farah's dresser, and we're going to use it for Evelyn. I'm just going to change the knobs on it. Um, I want to do an accent wall with wallpaper, but we will see about that. I have a little kind of secret. Um, can't really spoil it right now, or it's not 100%, so not really sure. Um, and then 22 and 23 weeks, I, it's kind of the same. I mean, not much is happening. I can really feel her kick now. I will, um, uh, I will go to like breathe in really heavy and she just kicks me so hard. It like scares me. Um, I love the smell of mint, anything mint, eucalyptus, like that's all I want to smell right now. Um, I've been having leg cramps, and this is actually right in front of me, so I'm going to show you guys. I um, am working with the company Body Boost, and this is their cooling lotion for feet and legs. It's for aches and swelling. It's cucumber mint, so obviously I love it, but it has aloe vera in it, blueberry, chamomile, and green tea. And it feels like that feeling when you have sunburn and you go to put aloe on and you have your fan on. And it's like, it's like, oh my God, so that's so cold, but it feels so good. So my husband, actually, I used this for the first time last night. My husband rubbed it on my legs and it felt so good. Um, I hate chicken right now. It's really weird, but it's weird. It's like, I like chicken sometimes from like fast food places or restaurants but I don't like chicken that we've cooked at home. Like, I don't know why they taste different to me. I can't personally cook chicken. I will vomit. Um, so I've really just been eating um, hamburger meat, which is very boring. So if you guys have recipes or other meats I should try, I don't really know what to do. I'm sick of having hamburger meat every night. Um, that's taco, spaghetti, hamburgers. Yeah, literally. I mean, my husband will cook chicken sometimes, like, for me to try. But every time, it's like, I just stick with whatever our side is, is what I end up eating. Um, Avery is moving. Hopefully, she stays asleep. Um, And, yeah, tomorrow, I will be 24 weeks. So, that's really all with my pregnancy update. Um. Thank you guys for watching. I would love it if you would subscribe and give this video a like. Now I'm going to show you the belly. So here is 24 weeks. My nice little stretch mark I've had with all three babies. Belly button ring ruins your belly. But yeah, that's 24 weeks getting there. Um... And don't forget to look at baby's crib and um, baby's sonogram picture. Thank you, guys. Mm -hmm.